Hey, well, good evening, everybody, and welcome to this CTFO Zoom event. My name is Adam Levy from Canton, Connecticut. This is the Biz Builders. We do it Tuesday night live every Tuesday night at 8 p.m. Eastern time live. And we got some great stuff going on in the company right now. We're going to be sharing with you some things. And uh, But to get us uh, kicked off, I'm going to turn it over to 100K Cowboy Doug Glaze. Cowboy, take it away. Well, let's start off with I'm not lonely anymore. I got some brothers <laughs> in the house. But uh want to start out tonight, landmark for CTFO. Ted went from the champ to the bounty hunter. He can find, he finds people across the world, puts their picture up just like a bounty hunter, and that bounty hunt has paid off. Congratulations, Ted and Michelle Wilson out of Canada. Man, what what dreams are coming true? And then there's Mr. Adam, the Tuesday night special. Yeah. <laughs> Adam, uh, congratulations. You've helped a lot of other people rank up. You're always there. Today you were on a three-way with me. David D was on a three-way. Uh, thank you for picking up the phone. Thank you for all your artwork and putting up little things that, you know, I don't know how to do that. That's for sure. But uh you're always there and you're always willing to help your team. And that's why you're at, you don't get into management mode, you stay in leadership mode. Congratulations to the both of you. And with that, I'll turn it over to 100K, Adam Levy. Thank you, Cowboy, appreciate that. And uh, yeah, you know, it's a team effort, obviously. And, you know, there's just a lot of people that um, are part of that story, you know, and uh, about a year ago, a uh, little, just a few days, plus a year ago, right, um, did, a, did a Zoom uh, with Al Diaz and, uh, and our good friend, Ted Wilson. And uh, Ted saw something here, and he saw something that he could sink his teeth into. And here we are a year later, and he's hit 100K just five, four or five days ago. And uh, we're glad to have him on. Ted, how are you tonight? You know what? I'm doing great. It's actually very cool that we're on the night before Valen's time. A Valentine's Day 2024. Feeling the love, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. And uh, I'm sure you've got some great big plans for Valentine's Day because as a 100K, Valentine's Day is better than as a 75K. <laughs> 100K, time to play. No, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. So, uh, Ted, you know, um, it's been a year and a lot has happened in the year and a lot of excitement. Uh, obviously, Xanthomis is what got your attention, um, a product that, you know, you were familiar with the main ingredient. You were familiar with Mangosteen. Um, you knew the power of it, but the technology is really what, uh, yeah. you know, had you decide that this was the place. But here's my question, you know, we've been involved in the industry a while, both of us, uh, you know, I think around a similar amount of time. And we've had the opportunity to see a few once in a lifetime chances to you know, hit it big in our industry. Um, and I wanna ask you, how does this moment kind of stack up to some of the other things that you've experienced uh, timing wise like that? And you know, how is this different, this time that we're in, this moment that we're in right now? Well, boy, that's uh, there's a few questions built into that. Uh, first of all, a huge congratulations to to both of you. Um, you know, um, Lisa is behind the scenes. You know, but behind the um, the business front runner, you have to have the equal and opposing support behind the scenes to do the time zone shifting calls, the in ad auseum work that it takes sometimes to be successful and still trying to maintain some balance in the home, it, you know, food prep, nutrition, sleeping. And so this is as, as much obviously a big win for Lisa as it is for you. So congratulations to the real 100K, Lisa Levy. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna love to hear that. <laughs> <laughs> it's been recorded too, which has been fantastic. Record. We'll be uh, we'll be putting that on loop, you know. <laughs> every morning, <laughs> you know, and, and no joking, you know, Michelle has been my rock. Uh, she has seen the good, the bad, and the ugly in this industry. We got together, 1995, after my first almost seven years of fumbling and bumbling. Hmm. Uh, I finally had my first sort of home run uh, year in 1993 after almost four years of doing it all wrong. 
Uh, but the fact is, is that it's not a smooth road. It's not, it's not perfectly paved, but it, it has gotten easier over the years. Um, you know, I'm 55. Uh, you're going, what? I'm sorry. Yeah, one person's on this. There's no way he's 55. <laughs> you know what? No, I'm 55. And um, I find that this stage of my life, it's a lot easier for me to cope with stress. Stress of hoping that someone says yes versus no. Hmm. The stress of being let down the stress that you think that someone is a perfect fit and they completely go 180 and someone that you don't even wildly think is actually going to do something and goes out and crushes it. So um, maybe like a good fine wine, uh, we've we've corked the wine and we're letting it sit right now. Uh, for those that are red wine drinkers, you'll understand the reference. Those that don't just understand that it's about being seasoned and, and, and being patient. Uh, I would say that this build has been way more organic in terms of the legitimacy of product-based marketing, meaning that we're not building on the sensationalism of getting now before it's too late, the angst of fear of missing out, FOMO, as my adult daughter has taught me the word FOMO. Um, it's more to do with the fact that we're onboarding with intention, the right people that want to be here for the right reasons. And let me elaborate on that. Adam, yeah, please to do. me, there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with the legitimacy of wanting to earn an income because of the need, because of hyperinflation, because of uh, too much month left at the end of the money, because of just feeling the squeeze, a credit card debt, uh, variable mortgage rates uh, going up for for those that didn't lock in a fixed rate, um, just the cost of a loaf of bread, uh, the cost of a gallon of gas at the gas tank, etc. And so there's nothing wrong with, with bringing people in on the notion that there is a better way, um, but it's more than just the economic solution. It also has to be in alignment with who you are as a person. Can you get excited about, it sounds kind of a silly question to ask, but can you get excited about helping people? Like it's actually a fairly important question to ask, don't you think? Like, I'm not looking for the strong personalities that are going to bulldoze people in like the bull in the China shop analogy. I'm looking for people that are actually more calm and considerate, more kind, that are actually enjoying the utility of building actual relationships, listening more than they talk. You know, back in the early 90s, I had a mentor that says, look at dummy, stop talking so much. And he was right, you know, two ears and one mouth, use them in that proportion, ask better questions, listen and understand what's going on in your prospects world, instead of just trying to get your agenda across in terms of fire hosing them with information about what's going on. So the build here to answer your ultimate question, Adam, I find that the innovation, and it took us almost a year, let's be honest, to really zone in on the sweet spot. What really is working is the concept and the idea that we're doing things different, not just a little different, a lot different. CTFO, changing the future outcome. Al Diaz, my great sponsor, a huge shout out to Al and Adelkas for having the courage to say, hey, buddy, he calls me champ. Hey, champ, I found the next home run. Are you open? I said, buddy, I'm always open to hearing. He spoke my love language because he knows I understand science, but he asked the great question, are you open? No, I'm closed. Like, who wants to admit that they're closed? You know, are you open? Of course, I'm always open. And then he massaged the love of science with my love language. And he, he drew me in. And then he brought in. And then he uh, used third Adam party, Levy. which was key. Yeah, he brought in <laughs> Adam Levy, and the perceived expert in the reconnection to the 8K club, Adam Levy. And the rest is history. My point being is that there is legitimacy of relationships taking place here. And there's legitimacy that we're doing things just a little bit different. We are not a me too style company. We're not just labeling, you know, products that already been done. Like the ultimate vitamin is actually real science. You know, if you actually talk to people, what do you think the word 10 X actually means? It means 10 times the bioavailability absorption. These guys have figured out a way to make fat soluble with water. I always talk about fat and water. They figured it out. What does that mean? It means that they've coded the nutritional element. So it safeguards it as you take it down in the stomach. 
it then during the gastric juices, the acids, the enzymes, it breaks down that double coating of the liposome fat coating. Once at times it hits the small intestine, now the nutrient has been now exposed and now it's easier fed into the bloodstream where it goes to work. What does that mean for you? You're not going to waste 90, 92% of your money. It's not going to line your toilet bowl. This is a technology. And so over the last few months, I've been saying with, with great reverence and excitement that this is the quality of your life. The quality of your gas and your gas tank is going to predicate the success of what, what we have a hold of. And that this has formed the basis of the innovation of CTFO. We have the Super 7. I always carry them with me. I'm always flipping people their sweet tart treats. And it's fantastic because it engages more than just the auditory and the visual and the kinesthetic. It's also olfactory and and uh, whatever the, the eating pathway is. Point being is that we're having fun. The innovation, though, doesn't get any better when you when you can twist and miss. And so when you have the newest product out here or the xanthomist, do you trust me? Yeah. O open your mouth. What? Open your mouth. Just trust me. We're having fun. And I. What that tastes like to you? Well, I don't know. Um, quite sweet. <laughs> Does it taste like a birthday cake? Yeah. Or, or cotton candy? Yeah. That's the future of healthcare, brother or sister. There's nothing to swallow. It's already in your bloodstream now going to work. Do you understand, John, Mary, Susan, Peter? Do you understand that this is the future of nutrition? And right now, I'm offering you Walmart stock at a dollar. Hmm. And you understand what I'm saying? This is going to go viral. And this is an opportunity for you to become wealthy. If you haven't gotten wealth, your goals achieved yet at your life. Could you give me 12 months? I didn't say 36 months. I didn't say the five-year plan. I said 12 months. Last, last Tuesday, I said a national call. I said, look it. Could you give me 12 months, put everything on hold and, and with, with absolute no fear, go massive action and talk to every single person you know, because the next 12 months will set up the next 40 years of your life. Now, that is my opinion, but look at Adam, you and I each got 36 years of experience. We know when we know, and this company is not a startup. It's eight, almost nine years old. Our company is about to go vertical and you caught us at $800,000, $700,000. I mean, you caught us at the very front end of this massive giant and you've got to just believe. So that's a long answer to your question, brother, but I'm here to tell you <laughs> my conviction is about quality of relationships and speaking the truth with energy. And you're mm. speaking, you're not messaging. Yeah, you can start conversations, but you got to get on the phone. You got to get on a Zoom call. You got to get in person. We had a we had a person two nights ago on, excuse me, um, three nights ago, Saturday night. On a Saturday night, they had seven people in, a ho in their living room. They did an in-home for seven people on a Saturday night. And all seven signed up. And that lady went 2K that night. Yeah. Getting back together with people is the key. And if and if you can gather people, I guarantee you when they see it, they understand it, they feel it, it's infectious. And there's a 60-day performance guarantee. It's a no-brainer. You know, I hear you talking uh, about being seasoned and patient. And I think that that's uh, very telling for somebody that's been doing this as long as you have. And it's something that we've gotten good at in, in just knowing that not everybody that we talk to it, this is going to be right for uh but certainly this has widened the market right because everybody who's got cells probably could use this um the other thing you pointed out was disciplining your disappointments is kind of what i how i hear it um and that you just don't you know you just know that uh, not everybody is gonna you know see it the way you see it or not everybody's gonna get on board not everybody's gonna say yes but you miss a hundred percent of the of the swings you don't take right yeah. <laughs> and getting back to people getting in front of people uh doing in homes like you're saying i mean these are the things that your group has done to get you to 100k in volume in in a year's time 
And uh, I just, you know, it's just incredible uh, what you've been able to accomplish, Ted. I'm just so excited to be in business with you and to be working with you. Um, this moment in time, you've seen a couple of moments in time. How does this really differ in your mind? Like, I know, I think, and I'm not sure, but I think you're more excited about this right now than you've ever been in 36 years of network marketing. Why is that? Yeah, I'm excited about the delivery, okay? I'm excited about the oral mist technology. You heard this on the last Biz Builders I spoke to a couple months ago, and I'll say it again. Do you guys remember dial-up internet 1993 when people were first introduced to the idea of a dial-up? You got to make the sound. <laughs> yes? Yes. <laughs> and then that wheel... Establishing a connection, then the electronic mail, and you type off your message, you know, whatever MySpace, and then you send it off, and then that little sort of that bar starts connecting, showing the progress. Well, that that speed of connection and connectivity, and the way how that 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 industry started is today's current nutrition space. Mm. We knew that the fiber optic, the T1 fiber optic, one gig up, one gig down, all these technology terms and stuff that the instantaneous high-speed internet, we knew in the nutrition space that this would be in place, in in in, in motion at some point. It's, it's just technology. The analogy that now has replaced my dial-up versus high-speed is simply... The iPhone, not to pick on iPhones, but you know, I'm an iPhone guy. I've got the latest iPhone, it's an iPhone 15, thousand bucks, whatever. Crazy. But here's the thing is um, it's a great phone. Okay. Um, that's you know, and there's lots of iPhone 10s, 11, 12, 13, 14. They're all good phones, you know. Those are all the glutathione products out there in the market. Those are all the fruit juices and the patches and the and the elixirs and the powder things that you have to shake up. And, and and I'm grateful for all of the iPhone 10s, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15s. This is an iPhone 30. It's just technology. You don't have to get into an argument with your prospect who's defending their precursor technology or their swishing product or their patch or, or, or. you don't have to go there. Even say, look, I don't want you to quit your other company. You're you're working hard. You're trying to make ends meet. You're probably making some money. You're trying to put Zach, you know, little Johnny through hockey or baseball or, or basketball or football camps or little Mary. I don't want you to quit, but you've got sales. And I don't want you to miss this. You can just be a customer because end of the day, when you reallocate your spending, we have a better ecosystem over here. What do I mean by that? We have a better product with a better money back performance guarantee, with a better comp plan, with, with only gotchas, with only the lowest $45 per 31 day qualifying period. We've got no structure requirements. I mean, we are registered to go viral here and all you gotta do is twist and mist. Can you give me four seconds a day? Four seconds a day and you're done. End of the day, I'm just telling you, Adam, I, I am more excited now than I was a year ago because Absolutely. of the delivery. And trust me, you will sit on council as well. We've got a we've got an NDA. Holy catfish. Is there seriously wicked stuff in the pipeline coming? I you know, that's just a give you huh? That, that is a, that is an amazing point too and i always try to bring this out to the to the team is that you know you might not have capitalized on this but i will tell you that this product attracted some really amazing leaders to our company like yourself ted and many others this is happening again right now only the leaders that we already attracted new other leaders that are now coming in as well right so now you've got a whole nother layer of leadership that is not going to miss this and it's bigger than this time and what ted is talking about is that this is an innovation company that continues to uh set the opportunity clock back to zero every single time they introduce a new uh missed product and 
Ted knows what's going on and, and, and you know, he knows what's happening when it, when there are things that are in the pipeline and we can't, of course, talk about them. But all I can tell you is that if you think oh. you might have missed this, listen, don't miss this. And by God, do not miss what's next. Okay? Adam, Adam, <laughs> look, at, it's safe for us to say what I'm about to say. OK. Um. And this is being recorded and it's fine, you know, and it's going to be put on the Biz Builders page and people are going to share it to their own page. That's fantastic. Anyone that's watching this recording, don't miss this. Now, here's my message. Um, Absolutely. Xanthomyst is inflammation, intracellular communication, immune support, sleeping, elimination. It's, a fant it's 12 products in one. Okay, Google it. Glutamist is... 37 trillion reasons why you want to be taken like literally not even figuratively or metaphorically i'm talking literally there's 37 trillion reasons why you want to be taking glutamist it there's 180 000 clinical studies on it right that's the thing that blows my mind we were excited with 800 clinical studies right 180,000. The future of this category, because of the speed in which the nutrition targeted targeted nutrition goes to work, I'm not speaking on a turn here. Nope. Let's just all go on a journey for a second here. What happens? What happens if? And I'm not saying this is happening necessarily, but what happens if a nano emulsion micronized mist innovation company, who is leading with the top German scientists that are leading this space with the top manufacturing micronized emulsion spray company with redundancy that's leading with a company that's got an engine that's being led by a guy that did almost two billion dollars in his previous previous company that is actually coming out with formulas that are targeted around well I don't know let's just say fatty liver syndrome you spray something Within 15 seconds, it's going to work to, to finally address why people can't get off their weight loss plateau. Mm. I don't, I'm just spitballing here with you. What about, sure. what about you know, that, that uh, little blue pill that came out about 15 years ago, the little triangular little blue pill for men, because they're hoping to still stay intimate and connected to, to their partner. They take a pill, hoping that at some point they will then generate a healthy response that they can then time it correctly, then go into the chamber and enjoy mutual time. Well, imagine if you actually had a product that when you were in the moment and you wanted to have uh, a rise of good time and you sprayed something and honey, let's roll. <laughs> How big of a market would that be? Okay, what about- seconds, what, right? <laughs> you know, what about sleeping? You know how big sleep deprivation is in the so world? So huge, so huge. And you know, you just need to have a good night's sleep because you got a really important job interview in the morning or, or or whatever. You just reach for something, spray, spray, good night, Irene. Level four REM level sleep. I don't, I'm just spitballing. What about, I don't know, what about road rage? You're pissed off, a guy cut you off in the interstate <laughs> and all of a sudden if you, you're in fight versus flight syndrome. You could reach for something just to calm the nervous system and calm the brain down. What about waking up on the wrong side of the bed? What about what about self-harm ideology? Hmm. Serious shit. Yeah. What about stuff around immunity and the need to get back? I mean, guys, I'm telling you, just be a be a visionary of your of, you be the CEO of your own business. This is bigger than network marketing. This is Nirvana of healthcare. And I'm just appealing to all of you, just understand that you are at the right place at the right time. And I'm telling you that my vision for what I just talked about, about a spray that's gonna be better than some per, you, know, you know, blue triangular, I'm just spitballing. I'm, I, I don't These know. These are all possibilities, true. all possibilities. That's it's all. all possibilities. Right. But we are the leader in the micro emulsion miss category. We are, we've got about a three year head start. We are going to become the Kleenex of facial tissue. We're going to become the Xerox of photocopiers. We're going to be coming like the stand out in this space. And you just got to put your foot on the gas pedal and talk to one or two more people a day for the next 12 months. And I promise you, your life is set up. It's going to change your whole life. You're setting yourself up 
for the rest of your life if you pay attention now and go to work now. That's the bottom line. It's not about being a salesperson. It's just no. about being passionate about something and having people, do you trust me? And are, would you willing to try something risk-free for 60 days that could potentially change the direction of your life? Let me repeat that. Number one question I ask, do you trust me? And the second question is, would you be willing to try something free that could potentially change the direction of your life over the next 60 days? I Absolutely. Mean, that's all we need to be doing. And that's what we're doing. For some people, and the last thing, Adam, yep. the three-way call. It is so vitally important that you do what's called connect calls. You need to actually open up your phone, start start a phone and then add with that little plus symbol, add a second caller in to demonstrate that there's support available. When you've even enrolled somebody, still have them welcome to the team. Make, you know, if Adam was my sponsor, say, Adam, I'm bringing on aboard my friend, Harry, about two o'clock. If you see me calling in, take the call. I got Harry in the line. Hey, he had one more question before I made the decision to join. That's a great question, Harry. I probably know the answer, but hold on one second. Don't ask permission. Let me see. You know, just hold on a second, Harry. Bang. Plus, add the call. Find Adam. Hit connect. He It rings. He picks up Adam. I got Harry one second. Now hit the merge button. Now you got a three-way call. Hey, Harry, great news. I've got my business partner in line, Adam. He's been with the company a little bit longer than me. He's He's a great guy. He's, he's a guy I go to when I don't know quite all the answers. Adam, this is Harry. Harry, this is Adam. Please be quiet. <laughs> Your job's done. Please be quiet. Because Harry now, it isn't even what Adam is saying. It's actually what Adam represents to Harry. Harry has just now seen firsthand that he's not doing this business by himself. He doesn't need to know all that the answers. He can do this business like Ted's doing this business. Mm -hmm. I still do three-way calls to this day with members of my team. How many? How many a day do you do, Ted? How many a day do you think you do? Just curious. Uh, well, I don't want to scare people off, but I am full time. I work this business probably in the prospecting, in the recruiting, yeah. in the onboarding, probably four and a half, five hours a day. So I probably of three, do, of three way calls. So you're doing a lot. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm probably doing maybe probably five or six calls a day because we're nice. teaching the culture of connection. Right. And that's a clue. That guys. You, got, you got to hear that number, right? That is a clue. Now, <laughs> obviously, it's he's got a group, he's got a team. They're calling him with people in tow. He's doing three way calls. But if you're not doing three way calls, you're never going to have a team that's going to call on you to do three way calls. Well, Deb Hall's in the room tonight. Deb hit 15K in her first month or first. How many three-way calls did Deb do in the first 30 days? She's brand new here. I mean, Deb, come off a mute for a quick second. Honest to God, how many three-way calls did you do to hit 15K? It's a, it's a fair question. Deb, you there? I'm, I'm here. I'm <laughs> sorry, I'm not at home. So um, how many calls did I do? I how, many, how many three-ways? How many three-ways? Uh, three ways, not enough yet, but I'd say anywhere from six to seven a day, you know? Okay. I know I did a couple of those, so I know you, I know you did. <laughs> yes, and I'm grateful. Well, congratulations. But look I've out, I'm going to double K. it now, guys. Absolutely, Deb. <laughs> Excellent. My point being, I don't mean to single out Deb, but Deb is one of our, you know, one of the company's latest rock stars that finally figured out that it's better over here and she's here building yes, and she it is. in her first month, <laughs> but she's got, but she's got 30 plus years of industry experience. And again, success leaves clues. She's Absolutely. not the lone ranger. Not at all. The, the lone ranger always dies in network marketing. You have to demonstrate that support is available. It's so, Even it's if so you're, important. What's that? It's just so, it's just so important. It, you know, people will see how you're doing it and they'll get to see that, hey, you're not in it by yourself because that's what their biggest fear is. How can I do this? How, and can I do this? That, there's a few people that get off to a fast start and I'm going to mm -hmm. just be, you know, this is the biz builders. This is calling the way it is, okay? Um, there are a few people that get off to a fast start, 30, 60, 90 days. They might go, you know, 2K, 5K, 10K or whatever, you know, whatever this, the growth is. They get off to a good start. They get up to a certain level. And all of a sudden, they're MIA. 
they're missing an action. They stop phoning you. They stop requesting a three-way call. What's happened? They're in management mode. Hmm. They brought in their 10, 15, 20 people. And now they're trying to hope to get those other people to do what they did. And, and although that's admirable, you know, the best way is for you to make sure that your team grows is for you to stay in quadrant one. Quadrant one is the upper Activity. left quadrant <laughs> is recruiting. And I spend about 80% of my time looking at my list. I have personally recruited over 70 people. I haven't kept them all personal because we don't have a place to think. Regardless, I've helped put them with people because it's about putting gas on fire. Geography, same geography, same circles of influence, perhaps the same background and business. There's strategy here to try to put like with like. But the point is, is that whenever I take my foot off the gas pedal, guess what happens? Within people. 60 to 90 days, you'll always see the ripple effect. If I've backed off and I backed off, I backed off in, in June, July, and August because that's our summer yeah. in Canada. The rest of the time it's fricking snow here. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> but the point is, is that there is a 90 day rule and it takes typically about 30, 60 days to get back in after you've taken your foot off the gas. Mm -hmm. So we go back in the build mode. I'd, you know, I'd hit 50K. Hey, I arrived. Fantastic. And then we went in the summer, like, you know, summer vacation mode to sure. a point. Finally, getting back into the fall, we hit 75K and all of a sudden, bang, 100K because we're back building the energy of people all working together. And, you know, when you have something that's like this, it opens up even more conversations, right? 100%. Ted, this has been a lot of fun. Uh, I got to thank you for, you know, helping to guide the future of this company, helping to uh, work on the presentations that we're all using, uh, you know, on uh, Tuesday nights at 9 p.m., the company's, uh, you know, corporate presentation that we do. Ted and I wrote that together, did some graphic design on it. And, uh, you know, it's something that's, I think, pretty powerful. And tonight, You've got Kali Butler, who's a 75K uh, legend in the industry. She's going to be at 9 p.m. tonight doing that presentation at ctfowebinar.com. Uh, Ted, this has been a lot of fun. We are kind of out of time here. We try to keep ours short. Uh, I just want to thank you again for taking the time out. You're awesome. And uh, for those of you that, you know, were a big part of this equation, uh, getting to 100K, I just got to do a shout out to you because it takes a team uh, to create that side volume that's needed to to hit those titles. When you have a, a runaway leg like a Cowboy and Al and Ted, and uh, these guys have just uh, crushed it. Um, but I want to thank certainly uh, Cowboy and Deb and Al and Adelkis, Ted and Michelle, Peppy and Mary, all that incredible uh, growth has been uh, inspirational. Uh, certainly Kevin, Stu, David D, all the three-way calls. Um, and then people that placed orders in the last few days that maybe placed a second order to try to help out. Uh, Evelyn Monrock, Vinny Zakia. This is a guy that hadn't ordered in like five years. Got him on the phone. I'm like, dude, just a two-pack, something, anything. <laughs> he got it done. Uh, Robert Reedy, uh, James Beard, Colin O'Brien, Gail Downs, Giselle Jarrett. Judy Womack, what a hero she was. Catherine Brissang, big time. Richard Ralph, the most um, underrated player we have. He's on the Zoom. My friend, uh, what an order that you placed over the last couple of days. David Gardner going to work, putting people in, and Nick Masters, what an incredible team of people that just, you know, went to bat to make it happen and had put me over the top. So I just have to shout out to everybody. Thank you all. Appreciate you. Uh, we do these every Tuesday night live at 8 p.m. Eastern. Adam Levy signing off. Thanks, everybody, for being here. Bye-bye. Thanks, Thank guys. You. Great call. All Thanks, right. Ted.